So let's talk about what's coming up on my channel for the month of July 2024. Bad days, entertainment rankings and reviews. Greetings, my fellow YouTubers. Welcome to Big D's Entertainment Rankings and Reviews. My name is Dual, better known as the Big D. And today I'm going to be giving, giving you my July 2024 schedule. Now this is what I've got coming up. I'll have some big reviews and some re-reviews. Well, some re will be regular re-reviews. Some will actually be not actual re-reviews, but redos of my reviews. And by redos, it'll be possibly the same type, but it'll be more different. And hope that these will do much better than my original videos I did. Uh, for some I did four years ago and some I did five years ago. Before I get into the schedule, let me go ahead and give you the Big D video, well, Big D's award for the videos that got the most views. I was afraid I'd have a humiliating month. Most of my videos had not done so well. I just got so upset that none of my videos had done so well, but at least a few did well. So the gold Big D goes to the most viewed video, and this just tore right through the roof. Considering I actually premiered it just a few days ago, and it's the Mummy Returns review, which tore up a pack to get 72 reviews. Well done. The Silver Big D goes to the second most viewed video, and it's the review of Cahill, United States Marshal, with 45 views. Very good, and that means you'll begin some reviews of some more John Wayne films later on down the road. And the Bronze Big D goes to the third most viewed video, and it's the Saturday morning TV log of the Terrible Thunder Lizards with 37 views. So congratulations to the winners. Now then, here are what's coming up on my schedule. This will include a few anniversary reviews as well, as well as a couple of new Wide World game shows, including number 60 and a Do You Remember episode. Of course, you'll also still get the Saturday morning TV logs as well. P.S. As I'm, much as I forgot too many times, I will go ahead and point out this schedule is subject to change, though. All right, so be prepared. Coming up after this, you'll be well later on. You'll be getting my review of Beverly Hills Cop, which I'm going to be doing this along with its two sequels in the next two days in order to promote the release of Beverly Hills Cop XL Elf which will be premiering exclusively on Netflix. I will look forward to that, and you will get a spoiler-free review of it. Now then... And sometime during the next few days, you will, you'll still get the rankings of films that I watched and re-watched last month, sometime during this very week, or during the weekend, okay? Okay, and on the 6th will be the Saturday morning TV log of the Completely Mental Misadventures of Ed Grimley. Sounds like that'll be fun, don't you think? On the 8th will be episode number 60 of Wide World of Game Shows. I was going to do a poll for this, but I figured on second thought, I figure I know just the game to pick for number 60. And that please don't shoot me, I decided to pick the craziest game show ever with the looniest host ever, producer Chuck Barris. That's right, I'm going to be doing the gong show uh, as my 60th Wide World of Game Shows episode on the 8th. Then on the 9th, the 10th, and the 11th, I will re-review the Descendants trilogy. Now even though my review of Descendants 3 did so well, got over 100 views, can't guarantee if it'll happen again. But I'm going to go ahead, but that's been five years Almost five years ago, I'm going to go ahead and re-review that in the first two anyway, because the first two didn't quite do so well. I'm hoping that's going to change, which I'm going to do in order to promote the release of The Rise of Red, the newest installment, which will be premiering exclusively on Disney Plus before it premieres on Disney Channel. So you will, and yes, a spoiler-free review of that will be coming up as well. Now, let's see. On the 13th, we'll be a Saturday morning TV log of a uh, rarely remembered 80s cartoon, Meatballs and Spaghetti. I will be looking forward to doing that one. The 14th, Bumper Stumpers, a 
The next White Royal Game Shows episode. Yes, I'm going to tackle that one. The 15th will be the first of four anniversary reviews. Now be Angels in the Outfield, which I've ju which from 1994 with Christopher Lloyd, Tony Danza, and Danny Glover, which is actually making its long-awaited premiere on Disney+. Plus. Yes, you heard me correctly. Angels in the Outfield will finally come to Disney+, Plus for the first time ever. On the 16th will be a review of I, Robot with Will Smith. On the 17th, since The Mummy Returns just blasted right through the roof, I feel what the hey, I'm going to go ahead and give you a review of The Scorpion King. Uh, yes, that should be fun, don't you think? <laughs> um, now, then, then the 20th will be a Saturday morning TV log of The Smoky Bear Show. Yes, I am going to do that since I've just learned that this year is Smokey, Bear, Smokey the Bear's 80th birthday. That's cool. So what better way to celebrate this legendary fi well character's birthday than my time out Saturday morning show from the 60s? Okay, and then on the 21st will be a an anniversary review, which will be When Harry Met Sally. I know I've only seen it once in its entirety, but I'm going to go ahead and give you a review of it anyway. Then from the 22nd, Again, to going to the 26th, I will re-review all the Wolverine and Deadpool films. Just those films. But these will be redo re -re reviews instead of re-reviews. Since I have reviewed these, told the stories of these films in their entirety. So I will do it again and hope they'll do much better than my original reviews. Those will be done in order to promote the release of Deadpool and Wolverine. Only at the end of the month, which, as you are getting a spoiler-free review there as well. Then, the 27th, the Saturday morning TV log, which will be number 225, and they'll be Paw Paws. On the 28th, will be a Do You Remember on TBS's first ever original program, Down to Earth. I'm looking forward to talking about that show. And the 29th will be a review of The Mask with Jim Carrey for its anniversary. I'm looking forward to doing that one. We'll also have spoiler-free reviews of other new releases, including Despicable Me 4, which will be coming up later in the week, as well as recent films, possibly. Maybe Love Lies Ble Bleeding. I may be doing that. Maybe, um... And possibly, um... What was that film called again? I think it's called Knox Goes Away, which um, stars Michael Keen. I will be doing a re I might be doing a review of that. We'll see. Details to follow. It should I get a date for that one, okay? Again, this schedule is subject to change, so be prepared for changes to come along the way, okay? Good. Now that that's out of the way, I hope you like the schedule. Are you looking forward to any of these good ones? I hope you are. And let me know in the comments section below. If you like this video, click the like button, subscribe, and be a part of the Big D Nation. Continue to help support my channel. Make it, make it grow and make the views grow. And my review of Beverly Hills Cup will be premiering later on tonight. So I hope you like this. And if you did, check out the top three most viewed vids for June 2024. The upper left-hand corner is my review of The Mummy Returns. The upper right-hand corner is the review of Cahill, United States Marshal. And the bottom left-hand corner is the Saturday morning TV log on the Terrible Thunder Wizards. And the bottom right-hand corner is the button you can click to subscribe. If you like rankings and reviews on movies, TV, music, video games, etc., then I'm your guy. Thanks for watching. Until next time, I'm the Big D saying, see ya.